new at 11. The stage is now set at Bulldog Stadium for a big memorial service honoring Jim Sweeney. It's going to be a celebration of his life. Uh, it's going to be uh, some tough times there, but it's going to be amazing at Bulldog Stadium tomorrow. The former Fresno State football coach died last Friday. He led the Bulldogs for 19 seasons and is the program's all-time leader in wins. CBS 47's Tony Body joins us live in the newsroom with a closer look at tomorrow's ceremony. Well, Ken, Fresno State is creating a game day atmosphere tomorrow, a joyous celebration where five to 10,000 people are expected to turn out. Everything is in place inside Bulldog Stadium for family, friends, and fans to celebrate the life of the man whom this very field is named after, Coach Jim Sweeney. You come in at 10 a.m., set up, have a tailgate. The gates open at noon, and then at 1 o'clock the celebration will begin. Two different programs will be handed out to guests on Saturday. This replica from Sweeney's Appreciation Night in 1997, as well as a traditional brochure outlining the service schedule. We have uh, video tributes. We have, you know, a, a long line of from a pastor speaking to former players to former coaches. No one knew coach better than his son, Kevin Sweeney, who played quarterback for his dad and the Bulldogs in the mid 80s. He taught life and he and he taught about accountability and responsibility and execution, you know, and just was an amazing guy. Former fullback Lorenzo Neal agrees. He was the American dream. He was a guy that worked hard and uh, was a leader, a leader of men. And uh, he taught me way more than football. He taught me how to be a man. The service will mark the end of a week full of emotions for Kevin. But it's been, for me, really positive emotions and uh, the week of reflection. And Kevin says it was a lot of pressure being the coach's kid at the college level. But looking back on it, he would not change a thing. So no regrets, not at all. All just a big time thank you for uh, to God for letting us have this unique experience. Now that ceremony is expected to last anywhere from an hour to an hour and a half. Then afterwards, around 2:30, fans are invited to continue the celebration out in the white lot. Live in the newsroom, Tony Body, CBS 47, on your side. Tony, thank you for that.